Today's creature of the day is the Shintao Saurus. Its name means Qingdao Lizard, named after Qingdao, formerly known as the Shintao City of China, where the fossils were found. It was a type of hadrosaurid from the late Cretaceous, 83 to 72 million years ago. It ate plants and grew up to 27 feet, or 8.3 meters long, and weighed 2.5 tons, or 2.8 short tons. It lived near rivers and swamps and walked on all fours, but could get up on its hind legs when necessary, such as times when it had to outrun predators like Zhu Cheng Tyrannus. It had a bony crest on its head for producing low-frequency calls. This was originally thought to be some type of head spike, or horn, giving it the nickname Unicorn Dinosaur. Over time, we realized this spike was only part of its head crest. It went extinct due to competition with larger herbivores and environmental changes. It was described in 1958 by Yang Zanjin, and there's one known species, Shintaosaurus spinorhinus. In media, it's appeared in Tarbosaurus, The Mightiest Ever, Speckles the Tarbosaurus, Dino Dex, Dinosaur King, Jurassic World Evolution, Jurassic World The Game, Jurassic World Alive, Prior Extinction, and I don't normally cover books, but this is a childhood book of mine. How Do Dinosaurs Say I Love You? And ironically, it's kind of hard to say I love you to that Shintaosaurus design. I mean, that's just a reptile unicorn. Well, that's a cool, somewhat misunderstood Chinese hadrosaur. Be sure to like, subscribe, and comment what other creatures I should talk about.